Damn. It's like seven of us. Boy, boy. I look stupid when I don't walk, yo. When you don't walk, it's like you're being pulled, but it looks weird. Are <laughs> mm, 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 mm. oh, we going to the island? What the hell is this? Thank you. What the fuck? Oh! Oh! Oh my God! They, they beating his ass with a gun, boy. Oh boy, boy, oh boy. What the? How you alive? Bullshit! I shot homie in the back of the head twice, and he got back up. What kind of shit? Yeah. Oh, got built. Oh, 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 okay. It's shooting a lot. It's shooting a lot. Damn, my man's fortified like a motherfucker here. Finish this stupid fucking game and I'll be back. It shouldn't be more than 30 minutes. All right. It's starting. Hopefully I can finish it. All right. Start with the story again. All right, man. I gotta do. Text someone real quick. My phone's fucking checking. For some reason. Your dead eye abilities has been improving. Da 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 da. Not really. Not really impressed. Alright. Uncle, uncle. Let's go do the uncle mission. Sadie will be the last. If she's farther away. Sure. No, not. You've already fucked me, anyhow. John Marshall. Ah, feels like old times. <laughs> Good to have the old gang back together again. Let's just hope things don't turn out like last time. There he goes. What'd I tell you, Charles? Boy is as sour as weak old milk. No wonder she didn't stay with you. 
Huh? Not even a retired two dollar whore would stay with you. That's the goddamn truth. Now you used to be decent company, but now you're worse than a snake with a toothache. All he does is whine, whine, whine. Excuse me. Oh, don't get all angry. It ain't gonna change nothing. You're hopeless. Uh. And I mean that literally. You got no hope. I mean, look mm. at you. Look at this place. Your dream home. I've had better nightmares than this dream. Oh, darling Abigail. I've changed. Come live with me in an outhouse. I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to take a shit in. What are you trying to say? It's awful. Is it's that Arthur chat? I know it's John's hat. It's gotta go. No, it's not Arthur chat. It Get can't be right. Self respect, you miserable may... sack of shit. Build Maybe a house upgraded. that a lady set mm -hmm. foot in. The place just needs a woman's touch. It needs leveling. No woman would touch this place. Now, I reckon these horses can have it down in a minute. Here, come on. Tie that end around the horses. You loop that end around there. Horses will pull it clean down. <laughs> we good? I think so. All right. Well, I like Charles. Let's get going. Now, just pull. You got this, John? I'll go when you do. Now? Now we head into town, buy ourselves a house, right out of a book. Same as if it were a bicycle. Where in town? Uh, there's a fella by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay. You keep working here. Uh, but if I don't go with you, who's gonna Just tell you that? need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, make him work. Whip him if you have to. Damn. I didn't really put much weight Let's into go, it last or I guess earlier today, um, but I'm excited. I'm excited to see what 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 we're gonna be um, what we're gonna be doing as John. Hoping after the prologue's over, John's good to go. Maybe I don't know. We'll see. I like being in the new or I like being in the old area. A whole lot more in the new area. What? What? The Skinner Brothers. I miss having all the money we did with Arthur, um, but John is honest now, apparently. Honest worker, honest man. Whatever dude I shit he's playing in here. I do want to try to get a fucking haircut or some shit. Is that like a possibility? I don't know if I if it's even worth it considering this is probably gonna die out. This whole uh Yeah. This whole thing. It's twelve fifty PM. So why is the barbershop not open? You see what I'm saying? Like some shit in this game really don't make sense. It might just be because He's not like the main character or something. Or, I don't know. We'll find out here in a minute. What? Well, please take a seat. I do know we need to cut his damn hair.
had like full. He can't rock. He can't rock the. <sighs> he can't rock the. The good old Arthur Morgan. Kind of sucks. Hairstyles. When have you ever seen him with full hair like that? I don't want to cut all of his damn hair off. Because then it won't look like him. I guess it don't matter. He wears fucking, uh, wears one of them weird ass hats anyhow. Good to me. He wears that damn, you know, the hat. I just wanted to make his scar more visible. Because he, he, does, he doesn't look like John Marston at all. But now he does. Looks more like John Marston than he did. Alright. This is my saloon right here. Oh, I remember beating the shit out of people in here. Hello, Just for Sadie. fun. Oh, John. Come sit down. Sure. You, uh, you got any work? Yeah. Well, there's always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except bastards, victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. And which are you, exactly? Me? In my time... All three, but same as most people. I guess. Well, funny thing about this job, well, opportunity, I just might get to be all three again. How you mean? <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, Shane Finley? Cattle wrestler? Murder, thief, child killer. He's wanted in five states. I caught him last week. He was disguised as a lady in a house for fallen women. I was bringing him in, and I got robbed by a professional rival of mine, James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. Yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south, waiting to head north, so they can hand them in to the state troopers in the north country. I'd given up on the job as just a bad lot, but now that you're here, maybe we can go rob them back. Mm. Is the money good? Yeah, it's real good. Plus, I don't much like getting robbed by no one. Come on. Where is it? We're heading again, you say? Mm. South. Now come on, mount up. We got a ride ahead of us. Of course we do. Say the other. Crazy. Oh, I miss pestilence. God, I miss my fucking horse. Follow me. So miss pestilence die. and famine. Yes, ma'am. I can't believe they killed my horse. That new horse? That. Some folk buy ranches, some buy horses. Horses are cheaper. He looks That mean. killed me. He is. Just having my horse die right. was the most emotional. Else, was the know. most emotional part of the whole entire game. He ain't had any trouble. Some squatters, but. I named that fucking it, horse. That's good. I fed that fucking Maybe horse. I bonded with that I horse. Maybe these stayed north or gone off somewhere else or dropped My down horse. dead in their own tracks. It's good country. All country is good. It's just folk that are bad. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Besides Uncle. Abigail? Uh, Abigail ain't come there just yet. Really? You, er, want to talk about it? Well, maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles? He's alive? Yeah. He's doing okay. He was prize fighting in San Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He 
took everything real hard. But I think life on the plains is gonna be good for him. I always like Charles. You send him my best. I will. You know, you can come along too. Build a cabin on the land. I've done that all before. Can't do it again. I'm on my own now, John. I, I ain't so good with people. Uh, the offer's there, whenever you want them. That's kind. Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. You heard anything of Dutch? Nothing. You? No. You'd think. He's a <laughs> colorful <laughs> character. Word would get out. That's one way of putting it. Look, what happened with the gang changed everyone who was a part of it. The Dutch who put a blanket True. around me after the O'Driscolls, that weren't the same man at Beaver Hollow. And now, True. he might not be so colorful no more. You see a man whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. We was fools to follow him. I was a fool and I paid for it. But I was one of the lucky ones. Micah, John. Micah's the one who set it off. I blame me yeah. for following Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything Definitely. else. He's out there. And someday, I hope we'll find him. But uh, not now. Come on. I love the old the old map Red Dead. Oh shit. Oh so, shit, you see what that is? Oh fuck, do you see what that is? Isn't that Twin Peak or some shit like that? Oh fuck, this is my area. The bounty some shit like got that. Got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? Shane Finley, correct. And we aim to have Langton give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though the giving back part is optimistic. I'm forever the optimist. Fucking John Marsh. Unbelievable. Doing okay, girl. There you go. We cut off here. Take me to Armadillo. <laughs> Tell me Armadillo isn't around here. This is the place. It's a view, all right. I don't look like armadillo down there, but I can't really see it. Oh, there it is. That has to be it right there. Come on, let's go take a look down in the valley. That's my area. Be quicker if we both look. You got binoculars, don't you? Anything? Not yet. Keep looking between here and that town. They'll be there somewhere. I think I see something. Yup. There they are, down there. Who's who? Well, the bounties, the feller who's all tied up. <laughs> Very funny. And that big fat feller with the funny hat, that's James Langton. The other fellas just work for him. Where do you think they're heading? Uh, come on, let's go follow him. Come on, lady. Looks like they're cutting through the canyon underneath us. Let's go. Go on. Yeah. They'll be coming through here. Whoa. There they 
Sharp. We follow and keep an eye on them. Yeah. Stay back from the edge. You won't get north through here. What are you doing, huh? You talking to me or like to sorry i ain't used to having anyone with me my guess is they'll stop up ahead if we can get a better look at them you know his thinking pretty well hmm? if you can't outgun them you gotta outthink them oh yeah well the, canyon opens yeah, up the best gun the we'll best gun in there. the gang was Arthur, the best shot in the gang, I guess. So, uh, John sure as hell isn't going to be much help. It's a joke. I think John's a little bit easier to shoot with. <sighs> or at least he feels like it. <sighs> Up here, get off your horse. This uh, might be our yeah. chance. And that sure is Shane Finley coming off the back of his horse. What are they waiting for? Uh, the rest of Langton's men, I think. <laughs> Langton's doing pretty well for himself. How come he's got all them men and you work alone? <laughs> I got you. You're worth ten of them. <sighs> Great. Damn, I'm a shot by accident. All right, so what you think? Should we threaten them, start shooting at them, or sneak down and pick them off one by one? I reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity, but uh, it's your call. Let's just start shooting. Maybe they'll all run off. Yeah, they'll scatter right away. I'm going over here. Okay. Damn, shot her head off.
with her? What's it look like? Uh, get him up there! Come on! Get on there! Uh, it didn't work out for you before, woman! <laughs> hey, don't shoot me alone! Now let's get out of here! Come on! Interesting. I need to relieve myself. There'll be a bucket in your cell. I'm serious. Yep, and so am I. Hit him, John, please. Hey, you don't need to do that just because she told you to. I don't need to be hit. I just want to be treated civil. Shut it. You heard the lady. Thank you. I still protest my innocence. This woman ripped me out of my bed, kidnapped me, then let Langston kidnap me, then you killed them all and kidnapped me back. I'm the victim here. Damn you. John, would you be so kind as to shut him up? Don't listen to her. Let me speak my piece. There's no call to hit me, mister. Listen to him squirm. Jesus. Bad dog. <laughs> That's it. How'd it work ain't easy, John? No. But I can see now it has its rewards. That's a whole lot easier with a partner. That back there, you didn't need a partner. You needed a whole company behind you. We did fine. And with Langton and his men gone, There'll be more demand for our service. <laughs> Sadie, you know I'm a rancher now. <laughs> Mostly. And I know how you're paying for your ranch. Don't spread that around. Hi, I won't. But it would be good to have you along some more. Yeah, we'll see. Maybe. Are we up north or are we back in Blackwater? We're back in Black. Okay. So we did a fucking. We went backwards. We couldn't have just waited till they got close to Blackwater. Here we are. Grab him and bring him in, John. Sure. You're a bitch and a bastard. We brought in Shane Finley. Oh, great. Let's uh, put him in the cell. Bastard! That's your cell at the end there. We're gonna watch you swing. What for? I didn't do anything. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Here. There's a decent price on Finley. Mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> uh. You want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. <laughs> it's John Marston here. 
All right, well, if you need any more work, you can find me in town. Or maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. 200 bucks, wow. Well. Not bad. Albert Cakes. Alright. So this is like the building of the house. Or the ranch and shit. Like the time before the time. Kind of a weird... What do they call it? Epilogue? Prologue? Doesn't feel much like a resolution. Guess we can't go in there. Maybe there's a way around back. No. Just so happens there is. How about that? Excuse me, sir. You work here? No, I just hang around here for fun. Ha <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. How can I help you, friend? I know this sounds crazy. Some dumb old coot I know is telling me there's these houses you can buy pre-cut. <laughs> Not crazy, friend. The very latest in modern convenience. Convenient and cost efficient. <sighs> Which house do you want? Wow, yeah, I can see the houses. Each wow. One is entirely unique, but also the same. Excuse me? Perhaps I'm going too fast, sir. Do you want to buy a house? I think so. I'll give you a luxurious, entirely unique pre-cut palace. And if you order today, I guarantee you're home in a matter of weeks. Maybe sooner. I'll take that one. Ah, uh -huh, yes, we have that one in stock. <laughs> I wish I, I already knew what they were talking about. Credit from the bank. Oh, fantastic. Now, you write your name here. And, uh, you sign your name there. And you will be the proud owner of a factory built home. It's that easy. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Martin. Albert Cakes Esquire at your service. You boys give me a minute. <sighs> what are you doing here? Everything okay? I'm not sure. Probably. A fella came by the farm. Got attacked on the road. He said the Skinner brothers was hanging around. Lots of them. I left Uncle Arm to the teeth back at the ranch. Who are these two? Guns for hire. This skin is about we need them. We ain't got that kind of money, Charles. You want to get robbed for your house? No, but... Hey, these skin is going to be nasty. Come on. Mr. Devin, you're with me. Mr. Wayne, this is... Milton. Jim Milton. Sir, good to meet you. We're going to be heading up to the Manzanita Post. Why? The best smith around is that Norwegian fella up there. Yeah, so they say. You boys ready? Yes, sir, we're ready. Good, because you're about to get shot at over a goddamn hammer. You want to build a house with a sniper rifle, then? I know old Neil's real well. I'll get you a good deal. Thank you, sir. All right, then. Let's go buy us some tools. I know the quickest way. Follow me. Say, is your friend a Negro or a Redskin? I think a bit of both, for what it's worth. Cash is cash. So it's all the same to me. I saw you getting skittish there, but don't you worry. We're not getting shot at. Oh, yeah. I know Charles Smith. If he's got cause to be concerned, it's usually good cause. You got a shotgun messenger sitting right beside you, all right? Now, suppose you don't know much about robbing caravans. Not much, I guess. <laughs> no. Well, nor do I. But I know a thing or two about protecting them. Do you? And if a robber sees some strong men sitting up front, two of them guns behind, then they're gonna wait for the next set of fools to come on through. Unless they take the guns to mean they're carrying something valuable. Instead of pre-cut timber and some tools. What? No, wait, look, trust me on this. You are overthinking it. You hire a gun, you hire peace of mind and a deterrent. 
Well, I'll sit here looking big and scary, and you can concentrate on the horses. All right. I'll do just that. Maybe I've done this kind of thing before, and maybe I can handle a weapon. But I'm not so different from you, partner. I think you might be. Mm. Hey, we're taking the next right up towards Manzanita Post. So, what were you saying? People wonder how you can handle it, living by your gun. But it's the same as any other occupation, really. When I get home, I put my gun on the rack and it stays there. I mean it, it, it really stays there. I don't even think about it. My mind's on my wife and the little ones. I'm chopping wood, mending the roof, putting the kids to bed. But when I'm out here, I'm watching the tree line. I got my gun at the ready. And I'm trying to make my employer as comfortable as possible. That's, uh, real good of you. You're in good hands. I know this country well. Yeah, you good. do. Am I finally gonna meet this tool maker? Now, Niels, he's an acquired taste, but boy, can he work metal. Norwegian, you see? Viking blood. Fellas up there used to worship a god with a hammer. Guess I figures they'd still be making them. I'm not sure how much English he speaks, but Niels knows tools. This is the spot, just up ahead. Okay. You boys wait here. After you, Mr. Milton. Nils. Nils, it's me. Willard Wayne. Okay. This is my associate, Jim Milton. Okay. He heard you was the best. Best smith around. He needs some tools. He's building a ranch house up at Beecher's Hope. Beecher's Hope? Okay. Have you got any made? Uh, okay. Like I said, an acquired taste, but a heart of gold, and he's the best. You off someplace, Nils. Okay. So Milton is uh, working with Cakes Hardwood and Timber in town. Should I get them to pay you and add it to his bill up there? Okay. Come on, let's get moving. Whew. Okay. <laughs> All right then, Beecher's Hope. They've been trying to sell that property for some time, haven't they? Took a look at it myself, as it so happens. Seemed like a lot of work. Too much for me, but more power to you. Must have seen something in it I couldn't. World need. Nice rods there. These are their skinners. No. 
Mr. Devin, you okay? Yes. That the last of them? I think so. There's more. They got the tools. They grabbed Mr. Wayne. All right, you stay here, guard the wagon. Charles, come on. Help, help me. Tools. Now where's Mr. Ah, oh, fuck. Chewing my ear off. He knew what he was getting into. Did he? Skinner. Everyone knows. Except me. Later, John. Charles! You alright carrying him? I got it. There's no use in you getting bloody too. Is he is it bad? They opened him up pretty good. Nearly chopped his head in two. God damn them! Uh huh. Mr. Wayne didn't make it. Here, Lord, no. We have to get out of here. You take him in the back wagon. Come on, help me. All right, let's get out of here. Oh my lord! What they do to him? Nothing nice. Yeah. John, I'm riding with you. Get us back to beaches. Those were the Skinner brothers. I told you I was worried. Sadie said something too. What kind of land have I bought? It's not the land. The Skinners move around. They're here for now. I thought this 
This kind of bloodshed was meant to be over with. What was all the nonsense about the civilization? Don't break our necks. Get us back to beaches. Those were the Skinner brothers. I told you I was worried. Sadie said something too. What kind of land have I bought? Slow down. It's not the land. The Skinners move around. They're here for now. I thought this... This kind of bloodshed was meant to be over with. What was all the nonsense about civilization? This kind of bloodshed is different. Folks have been killed, sure. For good reason and bad. But rarely just for the fun of it. That was fun for them? No. Not that time. Most folk don't usually put up with such a fight. Uncle! Uncle! Uh, 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 Uncle! You useless sack of crap. I was keeping guard. Really? Whoa. What happened? Skinner Brothers. Bottom? Enough. Once this is done, I'll take Mr. Devon back to town. You get poor Mr. Wayne buried. Okay. Be careful. Oh, I will. But I'm fairly sure we scared him off for now. Bad business. Well, we'll be safe together. Sure. You say so. And John, I love you. Don't you forget that. See what he's doing. Those plans make any sense? Oh, sure. Seems easy enough, I think. How hard can it be? <laughs> but I'll tell you what I think. Just to be safe, I'll do the reading and planning, and you do the building. How did I know you'd try to weasel out of doing any work? Oh, now, that is... Plain unfair. It, it's inaccurate and not what's going to happen. I'm simply going to use what I've got, which is a brain. Are you use what you've got, which is less of a brain. <laughs> Let's get started. Well, first thing it says the foundation, which involves moving those heavy wooden joists. Definitely not a job for a man with terminal lumbago unless you want to dig a six foot deep hole for me when the work day's over. Don't tempt me. Oh, here comes Charles. Maybe he can lighten the mood a little. How'd you get on? I'll be back, but not for a while. Charles, dear boy, John needs help moving these joists. Now, come on. Get a move on. We gotta get started before the rains come. You're very annoying. <laughs> He's right. We should get on with this. The building of the house. The infamous house. <sighs> I like it.
he wasn't even nailing it in. It was just... Well, let me have a rule and a saw and a board and I'll cut it. I'll climb up a ladder with a hammer and a nail and I'll nail it. Well, we worked so hard to build a little house together. In the snow or the rain or the ice cold wind, whenever. No matter what the weather, we're together. God, you know, it's tough. I can imagine looking like that. John looks sad. Very, very sad. I have to put back on the shirt, you know. I don't know if that was the right call. Well, let me have a rule and a saw and a board and I'll cut. Ladder with a hammer and a nail, and I'll nail it. Well, we worked so hard to build a little house together. In the snow, or the rain, or the ice cold wind, whenever. No matter any weather, we're together. What the fuck is this? Poor Charles, Charles, like, what the fuck are you doing? That's everything. <laughs> John Marston, you have a home. So do you. Oh, I know. And you, Charles, as long as you'll stay with us. Thank you. <laughs> Gentlemen, to this happy home. Well, at least till this fool gets his woman back. <laughs> My darling Abigail. Oh, Jesus. I hope you and Jack are doing well. I remain a fool, and I'm sure I shall die a fool. But I'm trying very hard to be something like the man you deserve. I have done something very silly in an effort to impress you, and that is I've purchased a home. The land you read about in the newspaper up at Beecher's Hope is now ours, and we are going to try our hand at ranching. Mr. Geddes kindly helped me buy the land. I met Uncle while I was coming out of the bank, and while I know your feelings about him, he has been enormously helpful in his own fashion. Charles Smith has also appeared and is unsurprisingly a pillar of strength. Together, we've built you a home. I hope soon to show it to you. I miss you and the boy more than I can express. Please, come back to me. Yours always, John. Few days later. Cowboy Builder. What's what is it? Let me see it. <sighs> Lay it on me. 
complete a new Jerusalem. Okay. What's the plan? The infamous house. Gotta love it. Uncle, I thought you was... Where the hell? <coughs> Shoo! Well, where the hell is Uncle? Oh, he's way out there. Lord. Okay. Okay. Just one time I hope to find you working. Just once. Do you believe in reincarnation, John Marston? No. Well, I hope and pray to whatever is out there that I get to come back as a youngin. So that when you're old and facing death, I can be some two-penny slave driver that comes along and hastens your journey into the grave. This is a fatal condition I got. And I'll give you another fatal condition. We don't get on with things around here, and we'll all starve. Get on with what? Farming, ranching, planting something. The only thing that this land's good for is grazing. Grazing? Yeah, so so cows, sheep, goats. Now, goats is easy, but they taste awful. I don't like goats. And cows, I've seen enough cows. Yeah, sheep then. But any livestock, you're gonna need a barn. Barn will take three of us six months to build. Oh, you don't build a barn, dumbass. What do you think this is, 1785? You buy one pre-cut just uh. like the house. This is the industrial age. The lumber <laughs> fellers all have them. That guy makes me hate the modern world. Oh, come on. I'll deal with them. Getting tired. Already, we just started the fucking game. Progress. We'll see the progress. 86%. More close. 6% more, and we've been live for 58 minutes. Hey. I'll take it. Into Blackwater. Let's go. I'm kind of already tired of playing with him. I like it. I like playing with uh, with him. With uh, John. This fella probably saw you. Them for it. Cause if I saw you walk into my lumber yard, I'd think exactly the same thing. Thinking about it? Huh. I might actually do this on my own. Oh, I can't let you do that, John. Let you get robbed again? <laughs> oh, no. You need someone with some sense to negotiate. And some charm wouldn't hurt neither. Well, and that's you, is it? With your famous way with people? Ah, you're in enough debt as it is. I got to help you all I can. It's my debt. I'll handle it. Yeah, but if they foreclose on the debt, I'll lose my home. And I do so like it there. You like it too much. You're far too comfortable. Ah, you ain't even got furniture. <laughs> this is him. How's little Emily? Emily? What? I'm sorry, I've, uh, um, how are you? We need a barn. A barn? Of course you do. All them potatoes. We're gonna uh, farm livestock. What's wrong with you? How many scar-faced loons you got coming in here buying pre-cut uh, homes? Here, uh, what you think? Uh, have a look. <laughs> Maybe that one. Yeah, that We're one. an excellent choice. We have a couple already cutting in stock. I'll have it sent to you in Blackwater. I'm down at Beecher's Hope. Oh, I'm sorry. Of course, this is my wife, Jerry. You see, she's uh, but it, it's great seeing you again, Isle. Yeah, it's and been you, a sir. Pleasure as always. Great pleasure. Love your work. Of course. 
How are we gonna pay for this? <laughs> Same way we pay for everything. I just wish I could help you, sir. You've mm. been a good customer, and I like you, and David Geddes likes now, you. I, I, but I, this I, man <laughs> is very annoying. Can you just give me a few days? Of course. I really enjoy begging and watching you make a fool of yourself. Well, I... John! Hey! Is that Sadie Adler? <laughs> hey. John, how are you? Well, hello, Uncle. Nice to see you. Oh, and you too. Oh, shut up, you old creep. <laughs> Listen, Sadie, I... You got any work? I'm kind of desperate. Work? Hmm. How desperate? I need money. A bunch of money. My debt's climbing up. You up for a fight? Is it legal? <laughs> oh, it's very legal, but it's also pretty dangerous. With you, it'll be fine, but I wouldn't do it on my own. I ain't got much choice. All right, then. Come on. <laughs> Look after him, Sadie. He's a delicate flower underneath. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Uncle. You're <laughs> so fucking funny. Get money coming in. And get a crew to help with that barn. On good authority, we can find this bounty at Painted Sky. I know the place. Okay, I'll call you. Yeah, I was about to say, why the hell would we go that way? I guess I understand, kind of, but I'd much rather just run straight across the uh, area. Probably gonna die right here. So who is this now I just saw Ramon why they probably. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Back down to where just we go was, ahead. New Austin. You're bound to run into them. Are they Mexicans? That ain't the way. Some and some Californios and some regular Americans too. Just like we were. And they're friendly, I bet. Charming to a fault. Ugh, the bad situation out there. Burnings, killings, you name it. Not much law except the sheriff of Tumbleweed. He's Tumbleweed. making a hell of a go of it, but there ain't much there to hold back the chaos. It's real wild, that country. That ain't much of an advertisement for the place. It isn't somewhere I vacation. But it's something to behold. If you're inclined, you should take a look. You know, I had some trouble of my own. That gang you was talking about, was they the Skinner brothers? That's them. They ain't nice. Nice weren't what I heard about them. Got a hold of this fella I'd hired. Ah, oh, he didn't die well. Mm, I'm sorry, John. We fought back. We was too slow was all. I wish we'd done better for him. I'm sure you did the best you could. I've heard, well, uh, the kinds of things they do to men. Unspeakable things. I hope that's the last you see of them. Me too. But if not, I mean to be ready. That is wise. You want to hear something? I built my ranch house. Good for you. Did you make it out of straw bales? No. <laughs> It's one of them pre-cut ones. Me and Charles put it up, and Uncle watched and barked the odd order at us. It's solid, though. Real good and sturdy. Woo! John Marston's got his own house. You should come see it. It's good country, Sadie, despite all that. I try not to fraternize too much with employees. You know, it sends the wrong message. Oh, that's what I am now. An employee. Mm-hmm. That's what the bank says. This is painted sky up here. Looks quiet. Ramon Cortez, you better be here. You search that barn. I'll take the man. Holler if you get him. Ten. 
We've come for you. Come. Uh, it'll all be over soon. Damn. Got them fucking bananas. You got him? Yo, I just knocked him out. I think much. so. He just tried to kill me. That's about right. Yeah, that's him. Come on. Let's get him to the sheriff. Come on, Ramon. Let's go for a ride. We're going to Rhodes. Rhodes? It's different there now. Gives me the creeps. Hit your horse up here. How do you do, sir? Bring Cortez round the front for me, will you? I'll get them ready for you. Come on. I'll give you a hundred dollars to kill that bitch. Two hundred! Three hundred for her head! Be quiet! Mr. Sheriff? Mr. Sheriff, we got Ramon Cortez. Cortez? Sure did. Well done, Hal! Found him hiding in a pile of shit. <laughs> That's about right. <laughs> How you doing, Ramon? Oh, just fine, mister. <sighs> <sighs> Hey, how much you want? How much any of you want? I'll give $2,000 in gold to whichever one of you sets me free. <laughs> I'm afraid it's a bit late for that, Ramon. You've been a real bad boy. Me and my boys are gonna ride you into San Denis and watch them hang you. <laughs> okay, okay, if you think so, mister. <laughs> oh, I know so, Ramon. Mm -mm -mm. Take a seat. Help me guard him till my boys arrive and we can get him out of here. Sure. Uh, spent years cleaning up this town. Last thing I need is fools like this thinking they can take us back to the bad old days. Well, you did a good job. <laughs>
my jail apart. He's gone. He's gone. Uh, well, we brought him in. Now, pay us what's owed. He ain't here now, madam. I don't get paid unless he makes it to Saint Denis. You want to get shot today as well as robbed, mister? Are you threatening me? Why would we bother threatening you? Get him back and I'll get your money. And another $50 besides. A hundred dollars. Seventy-five. I can't go higher. Done. Let's go, Jim Milton. Mount up. Where are we gonna find him? He said there were men meeting him at Dewberry Creek. Let's start by looking there. Sure. You've had some bad luck with bounties being stolen off of you. And you're about to have some bad luck with getting punched in the face. He got stole off both of us. Someone must have talked. One of his boys, maybe. We were sitting ducks, waiting all that time in that Jim Crack jailhouse. Yeah, yes we were. I don't like it. The sheriff's done a lot to bring Rose into line since the time of the Grays and the Braithways, but clearly he ain't done enough. Life got... We gotta get there, come on! Okay, come on. So, you were just talking about something. So you think we can trust him? Yeah, he'll pay up when we come back with Cortez. He's a decent fella. If we come back with Cortez? We're coming back with him. Don't you worry about that. It's an odd thing, isn't it? We'll take $200 from a sheriff who might be crooked himself to go get a bounty. But we won't take $2,000 from an outlaw just to let him go. If that kind of offer is tempting to you, then go right ahead. But not when you're on one of my jobs. I never said I was tempted by it. Everyone's got to choose what they're loyal to. Themselves, God, the state. If a bounty hunter wants to last, the loyalty's got to be to the one that's issuing the bounties. Plain and simple. I got a reputation for honest work. So, everyone with a price on their head deserves it, you think? Sure. No. I don't know. Usually. If I got into who deserved what, second guess every poster, I'd tear out all my hair before I put a rope on anyone. If the price is high enough, you got to trust there's a reason they said it. I hope that rationale works out for all of us. there a fire i'd wager that's them stay on the road let's find a good vantage point yeah. up here come on i think there's an old water mill by the creek bed there it is. Keep some distance. We need to take a good look at him before we do anything. Must be camping down there. Why are they hanging around? Probably waiting for a boat. Uh, there's supposed to be a storm coming through, so maybe that's delayed them. Perhaps. So what do we do now? I'm gonna go get them. You. Me. You just cover me. I ain't getting you killed out there. <laughs> but it's okay for you. I, I want to die. And besides, those bastards don't look that tough. I, they look asleep as far as I can tell. I'm gonna go. You sure about this? Just don't seem right. This is my show, John Marston. 
Do as you're goddamn told. And shoot well. Get shot. Oh, hold your horses, chica. Get out of there. <laughs> I said, get out of there. Easy, easy, girl. Oh, you gave up easy a long time oh. ago. <sighs> hey, look out. There's more of them coming. Hey, estoy aquí. Shut your gut down. Oh. Oh. Just be. Son of a bitch. Well, that's that then. Help me load this fool on the horse. A lot of crazy bastards. Seems Mexico's a tough place. Too tough for you, John Marston. I'd stay well clear. Oh, I mean to, Mrs. Adler. <laughs> Time to go. It's about time we collected this bounty. Second time lucky. What do you think, Cortez? You got any more surprises up your sleeve? Hold your horse there! Come on, sweetheart. Let's all stick together. So, back to what you were saying. Ha 
find you, and we will kill you, you, and anyone who is close to you. I preferred it when you was offering money. Oh, you want money? Hey, take my money. I got gold, lady. But you was just saying you was gonna kill me. Oh, you let me go? I'll forget about all this. You see, Ramon, what we got here is a trust issue. Oh, I'm good for it. You're tied up on a horse. About to be taken to San Anita Hines. You ain't good for anything. Listen, I swear. Of course. Because all you can do is swear. But you're just saying anything you think might get you out of this. Ramon, I couldn't trust you to pay me. I couldn't trust you not to kill me. Hell, I couldn't even trust you to kill me, if that's what we agreed. What the hell are you talking about? I got gold, woman. Mr. Gold! Five thousand dollars! Well, I hope you left it to someone in your will. Cause you ain't gonna find much use for it in the short time you got left. I damn you, woman! Damn you! Oh, I've been damned a long time, my friend. Relax, mister. We ain't got far to go. Oh, you made a big mistake. We got him, Sheriff. We got him. I knew you'd be back, Ramon. <laughs> you just can't get enough of me. Put him in the wagon for me, would you? How's the jail? Needs to get fixed up since this nice man blew a hole in it. Yeah. Me and the boys will ride him to sand and knee right away this time. Come along, Cortez. Sheriff, before you go. I'll pay you when I deliver him. Plus $75. Exactly. Now, goodbye. Let's go, boys. I'll see you soon, amigos. Shut up. <laughs> Thanks for this, John. You send my money to the bank for me. Of course. I'm supposed to be retired from this. This? For nothing. Just a simple arrest. Money for old rope. If you say so. See you around, partner. Yo, why is this game so long? Stay by this post. What'd you say? Why is this game so long? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's being drawn out for no reason. How many? What epilogue you on? Two? Still? Oh, or three? Fucking two, dude. Uh, how long Jesus. If there's a part three, I'm literally like, there should only be there. There should really only be four more missions. I've done six. There should really only be four more missions. But I'm only 
I'm only fucking. I think there's another prologue. I think there's another epilogue because I have only 87% of the story done. You fucking serious? Mm. <laughs> How much shit happened before Red Bed One? Like, boy. I mean, a lot. This whole, the whole thing that I'm doing right now is like building the house. Like, it's all like happening before the the house is built and everything. So it's really cool. It's cool and stuff, but I'm I'm assuming by the end of this game it'll lead into Red Dead Redemption One. So I, damn, I'm, a lot of I'm, shit, a lot I'm of guessing shit happened, I'm guessing it's gonna show how he got arrested and what what happened. I'm guessing that's what's gonna happen. That make the other sense. Uh, John, because uh, in Red Dead Redemption One, John is uh, hunting down Dutch and Bill and Javier. Because, uh, because, is because John is, uh, Hunter's, he's working with the FBI, because he has to, because they have his family. Say it again? Um, the FBI has the John's family, the FBI has, mm -hmm. has John's family in Red Redemption 1, so John has to, uh, find and kill, uh, Dutch, Javier and um, Bill. Okay. So I think that's it's gonna lead us into how he got arrested, because Jean had to have got arrested to for the FBI to have got him. Obviously. Yeah, and him to show up in our do our um uh, be interviewed. I have done a hundred and one missions. How you know that? It says a story on progress. Total, yeah, when you go to the progress, go to total completion, and it shows you how many missions you've done. 67? Uh, how many you did again? 101. Uh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. When does he fucking die already? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm just, I'm inter and I'm all, and I actually, I've actually, um, actually 70% done with the game, which is really good, actually, like the whole entire game, total completion, so that's kind of cool to see that I'm 70, at least 70. I almost found all 10 horses, I found 7 already, I was just going around, just going yeah. around for shit. I got all the horses, Before. I got all the I'm gangs. I almost got almost all the strangers and all the chance encounters. There's a lot of chance encounters in um, what's that city? Robert. Saint Saint Saint. It's that place, Saint something. There's a lot of them in there. Mm -hmm. It's like freaking like I think like like seven or eight of them in them strangers in that in that one area, mm -hmm. which is good. All right, into this bullshit. And I hate this fucking dead eye shit. <laughs> Especially when I try to aim and he's wibble he's wobbling and shit. I hate that. What the fuck are you wobbling for? You ain't even drunk. Yeah, the aiming really, really sucks. Even when you're standing still, sucks, it's still man. it's still like wop the aim is still wobbly. I don't really appreciate I don't really like that, but I guess I don't appreciate that. Yeah. When I was on the island and I was shooting at myself, Roll Roll, thanks for that shit. What's going on, thickums? All right. Hmm. Um, yeah. When I was when I was on the island and I was um shooting at them from the top of the tower to the boats. Yo, my man is wriggling and wobbling. Yo, what the? F I hate Arthur. I'm like, yo, I hate Arthur. What the fuck is he doing? What are you doing? Like, why are you wobbling and wobbling and shit? You're not even fucking drunk. You only do that when you're drunk. What the fuck is going on here? Oh, shit. All right. I'm gonna finish this fucking mission and I'll be back. Let's go ahead and get this shit done. Let's go ahead and mop this fucking mission out. Good job. Well, that crew did help. The house, the barn. Look at this place. <laughs> I can't believe it. Thank you. Thank you both. 
This calls for a drink. Does it? Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. But we go better when we've brought our four-tack to Cathead. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out, and then all hands to see. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out, and then our hands to see. What's got at sea we spend on shore on sweethearts and our wives. What's got at sea we spend on shore at sweethearts and our wives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us marry be. Our can is full, let's frighten out, and then our hands to see. Yeah! <laughs> mm-hmm. John! Get out here! Dijo. Uncle's gone! He's fine! Let me sleep! Get out here now! Damn. That's tough, sleeping on the floor like that. That's tough. That fat man will be fine. No, he won't. Skinners. You think? My guess is they went that way, but my other guess is they know we're coming after them. What choice do we have? None. We just gotta keep our wits about us. We know this is a trap. You're damn sh 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 yeah. Let's go. I tracked them to the road. We'll pick up the trail there. Shit. It's like we forgot about it. We should have been ready. It happened. This Nothing we can do to try and get him back. Get our guards down for one moment. Hush. Up here. You see that? Blood. Dear Lord. They've gone up towards tall trees. Come on. John, look, we should agree on something. If it's really bad, this might not be about saving him. What the hell are you talking about? If it's really bad, it might be better to stop the pain. Jesus, you mean to... I mean, you can live a week without a scalp, but it ain't a good week. A gut wound, you can live a month, but it's horrible. What they've done to him might have killed him already, with only hurt to come. We get him. Did you hear Damn. something? Yeah. You think they That's saw tough. us coming? I don't know. I guess we'll soon find out. We'll be better off going. Ball Indian foot. boy. Okay. Leave the horses in the trees there. Come on. Ah. Up there, to the right. Two skinners. Look out. Probably. Take one. I'll take the other. They're down. Move. Keep your head. We'll find him. Come on. Hmm. All right, then. 
Hold. Patrol to our left. Shh. Shit. <laughs> Y'all got me Let fucked go. up. Y'all think I'm pussy? And we're looking for something. Us, most likely. Come on. Let's find where they're all holding him. Why are we still crouching over there, Charles? We just shot. Three bullets. Fuck that! He's gonna take us to them. I don't give Damn a it. fuck. We have to find him ourselves. This poor Hold fucking me. dude. Are you, you ain't kidding me? You ain't even gonna try to let the motherfucker go? That's crazy. Charles ain't playing no fucking games. Run, boy! What's up? What's cracking? What, what'd you say? Going to bed? Alright. Alright, Rich, if you're in here, I'll see you later, brother. I'm gonna finish this motherfucking game, dog. Get this motherfucking I I game down. Uh huh. Story's killing me. Yeah, that must be their camp. What do we do? Talk any Let's fucking louder and they'll be able to hear you. Hang in there, old man. Oh, man. Okay, okay. I can't see. Went through this mist. Can you look too? Hold on. That guy ain't got a head. Oh, oh what the fuck? My God. They about to burn my man? Careful. Where are they? Right Where behind they? you. Watch. I don't care. Come on. Told you. It's all that. That's predictable. Now you're gonna get killed. Can you shoot? Oh shit! What? All right, kids. The surprise is over. We're here for you. The fuck? Fuck the bullshit, I ain't going nowhere, I'm... I just cut him. I didn't even do I nothing okay. like that. You look awful. You'll be okay. Those bastards. We got him. Oh, they burnt my man. Oh. Looks like we got here just in time. God damn it. Okay, we're okay, burning his back. What? That's crazy. He's got his ass out and everything. What the fuck? Who the fuck? Yeah. Whoa! What the fuck? Yo, these cats are crazy. They got a head cut off and uh, they hang, they hang two people. He said, "I'll deal with this." Like you got. Gotcha.
yikes. They really ain't that far from the house either. A little wild. It looks worse than it is. Birds don't always heal easy. Sure, but I think this will be fine. As long as it don't get infected. It's much better than I feared. Hear that, old man? This could have been worse. He's pretty weak. Yeah, I bet. Stay with us, you old bastard. I don't feel good. Over here. Almost back. Hang in there, old timer. I'm feeling real weird. Easy. Over dramatic ass. <laughs> Tough enough, Buttercup. You just got your fucking back burnt. <laughs> I play. That shit probably burns. That shit burns. Of course it burns. But this shit probably hurts. I got you. I got you. Looks tough. Thank you, boys. Don't mention it. I thought I was dead. Uh, don't get all sentimental now, old man. You know, I really think you're dying. It's gonna be okay. A few days, you're gonna be just fine. You're a survivor. Easy, easy. Okay. He'll be fine. You think they'll be back? Maybe, but I doubt it. We must have killed most of them. Now, this is your land. Was it theirs once? I don't think so. I met a fellow said the Skinners rode down about two years ago. They're just angry men on a rampage, and we got in their way. Mm. Sort of like we used to be? Yeah, exactly like we used to be. Maybe we should take up torture. <laughs> uh, we got Uncle singing instead of torture. We're gonna be safe here, John. Hmm? I wonder what you, happens to Charles. Your family? Charles no, has to die. Charles has to die. I hope so. Wonder what happens. I really do. If she ever comes back. <laughs> Five more missions, I think. No, three, right? Till the end of the epilogue. Part two, before I get sh thrown into another fucking part. It's hopefully more enjoyable than this trash. Are you gonna cry, John? A little cry. Fuck. You. You're. What the fuck is this? What is this? I. He always did have that fine way with words. Trash. You doing all right, son? That's how they come sure, back. That's trash. Can I go see the house? Sure. Just give him some time. He'll warm up. It's quite a place you got here. It's yours. Hmm. Shut up. Ours. I should see about that boy. Who's my new <laughs> rival? Oh, that's Rufus. He's loyal, dumb, and angry, so he reminded us of you. 
That's your idea of a joke, man. Uh, that's his. That's his. That's his wife. That's Abigail. Oh, Abigail. Come on. I can't. Is that the? No, I can't be. Well, that means that there's what? Oh fuck! Now they hit us with two missions back to back. What's that? Jack and Abigail. Fuck. 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 Eighty hapers. Fuck. Three more missions. I think. I think we got three more missions in this epilogue. Oh. I swear I'm only doing three more missions and I'm off the game. I swear to God. It's tough, man. What I'm saying. Literally what I'm saying. Fuck John. I don't want to play with John. Like, why? I understand. How you getting on, son? I understand. I, I already know what they're going to do oh, at the end of this epilogue and shit, so it's Reading. obvious. And uh, playing with the dog. You wanna go fishing or something? Not particularly. Uh. I don't really like fishing. You do like eating though, right? Cause we gotta find some food. Come on, you little bastard. Come on. Let's head this way to the stream. Okay. Sorry. Why you gotta be like that? Uh. I'm sorry. It's okay. Do you wish I was more like you? Like me? No. But... Let's keep going. Can Rufus come fishing? Dogs scare the fish. Yeah, that's what I'm, that's what I'm thinking. But the end of this is the start of the next, like or the start of the first one. I guess. It'd have to so be. It's what they're shaping it all up to be. You don't be. care if we don't catch fish. Yeah, I... I'm not very good at this. At fishing or, or walking? At talking with you. But fishing will be fun. Sure. Unless you want nothing but beans again. Oh yeah, no, that well, whole Breacher's Hope is from the I'd first like game. That's, I mean, that was, that's what we were doing. Fun, I promise. Which I figured that once we got John, that that's what this whole thing was going to be about. Can't say the right thing. And you, Pop. Making it all fit together. We should fill in the gaps, basically. Let's do more of this. Sure. I, I mean, yes. I'd like that. Pretty countryside, ain't it? I guess. Grass and the light. There's a lot of ugly in this world, but sure as hell is a lot of beauty. Yes. You'll see it better when you get older. It's tough at your age. Just land and life. But to me, it's... It's... This is a real good fishing spot. Folk always say that. And hours later, they've caught nothing. Ain't you just the leading authority on everything? Well... Ain't it so? Well, maybe. In this case, it's true. I hear there's some real big fish in here. Big old steelheads. Hard to catch, but real good eating. Hard to catch. Get your excuses Pretty in much. early. That dog of yours know he's owned by a complaining know-it-all? Come on, son. I'm sorry. No, you ain't. It's all right. Come on, let's fish. Oh. <sighs> Uncle Hosea, he was the fisherman, wasn't he? That's right. I remember Uncle Arthur taking me, though. Arthur taught you how to fish now, did he? Huh, yeah. I suppose he did. That's nice. I got a bite. I got a bite. All right. Now, stay calm and start reeling them in. Not too fast. Want to set the hook in tight. He's he's strong. Good. Now reel him in. Stay calm. 
Give him a tug. Now reel. I got him. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? How do you feel? <laughs> I don't... I feel... I don't know. Thanks, Dad. I told you this was a good fishing spot. You did. Hey. My trip with Arthur... I remember now. I picked some flowers, and... A couple of men showed up. Dressed like they was from a city. No one like that's gonna show up here. Thank the Lord. Where's Rufus? I don't know. Relax. He's a dog. Where is he, though? I don't know. I'll go find him. Rufus! Come on, boy! Rufus! Here, boy! Hey. Let me come help you look. This ain't like him, Pa. Can you go search the other side of the track? Rufus! 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 Is that fucking dog right there? No, that's a goddamn goat. <sighs> yeah, I said, you know, the skinners are out and Jack's just fucking walking around. I see. He bit him. Calm no. down, boy. And Jack, you calm down too. Come here. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do, Pa? Whoa, you're gonna suck the venom out of his fucking. Is it all out? Uh, yeah, that's weird. Dad, Rufus, no. Are you sucking? Don't swallow it. <laughs> He's gonna die! He's gonna die! He'll be okay. You just gotta get him somewhere warm and calm. He's gonna die. Go get the fishing rods and the fish. I'm taking the dog home. Abigail! Can I get a hand? What, what's going on? Dog got bitten by a snake. Let's look after him. And the boy. Grab his rug. Is it gonna be okay? Jack, the dog is gonna be just fine. We never should have gone fishing. Sometimes. Sometimes Jesus Christ. You just don't know how things are gonna turn out. But how the, how the fuck the dog the dog's gonna be fine. Are you crying over a fucking It's okay, son. Chill out. Chill 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 out. Isn't he like what, thirteen, fourteen, something like that? Chill out. chill, chill out. You calm down. Crying over a goddamn Dog, are you fucking shitting me? Big ass pussy. There you are, Missy. Above the age of 13. I think so. <laughs> and I did good? You did good. So. <laughs> am I forgiven? <laughs> Never. <laughs> ah, you are a hard woman. <laughs> Ma! Pa! Come out here! 
Sadie. <laughs> You're alive. John, it's... Sadie Ann. <laughs> well, how'd you know she was... We... I saw her. I you thought I... You well. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> uh, well, come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but tell me about you, darling. No, armed to the teeth like that. I'm a working woman, Abigail. I'm a bounty hunter, bodyguard. I protect the gold prospectors up in the hills. I'm thinking of starting my own transportation business. I was thinking maybe if John wanted to earn some money. My husband, uh, he ain't looking for that kind of work. Took on a lot. Whoa. Whoa, 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 Abigail. Take your ass back wherever the fuck you came from. Don't be telling me what type of work. Uh, <laughs> oh, fuck. Hold on a minute. Oh, 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 bitch. Let me start off. <laughs> out of debt when we bought this place. And you're working for her to pay it off? Yes. Sometimes I was. But I thought we said no more of that. No, you said that. What else am I going to do? I'm a goddamn man. It's Jesus. Work out, Gail. And I never got killed. It's hunting down fools for the government. Easy. Even Jack could do it. Don't you put those stupid ideas in the boy's head. He's going to do something better than this. Like what? Writing silly stories? Okay. I'm sorry, Abigail. John, what? 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 Are were you? Was that necessary? What were you gonna do? Make fun of? Make make fun of the fucking uh? Just go ahead and make fun of the fucking, uh, the kid, your son. That's, that's crazy. Um, wow. That's crazy. <laughs> wow. That's really, it. Look I at the, the kid's I face is my face right now, huh? Huh? Just thought if you wanted to earn some money. How many Jesus. times do I gotta bury you, John Marston? What? Never. You ain't never burying me. It's legal work that I can handle. There's a. The fuck else are you gonna there's do? There's something else. Uh oh. Micah? Bounty oh, hunting yeah. is one thing, but goddamn, Micah? I heard he was up country, or some fellow who sounded just like him. Killed a family, bar a little girl who escaped. Leave Micah alone. Listen, I'm sorry, are you Abigail. Oh, Ab <clears throat> Abigail, I'm gonna fucking shoot you and Micah side by side if you don't shut your fucking mouth. Mike is dead. Mike has been dead. Mike is so fucking dead. It's not like Mike is dead, dead. Like if we're talking real life shit right now, Abigail. Me and you are gonna have some real fucking problems here in a minute. Oh, hawk tie you. Came by cause I was she might even like fella, it. And I thought John wanted to earn some extra money. What is it? Abigail, we need the money. Some fella robbed his business. You know, an accountant or something came down from Rhodes, I believe. Mm -mm. How much does it pay? It pays good. Well, the soft ones usually do. Okay, then. I guess. But Micah? No. All right. John Marston, let's go. Just you bring him <laughs> back to me. You hear? Shut of up, Abigail. God damn. Shut of a bitch. Stupid fucking bitch. Okay, man. Oh, why would you get married? Why would you get married to somebody like that? I guess they're not really married, are they? They're just kind of like... I don't know. I don't know. How the fuck you fall in love with somebody like that? Why'd you have a kid with somebody? Well... Well... <laughs> wait a minute. I <laughs> guess he didn't know he was having a kid. Maybe he did. He must be so pleased, John. And the ranch? You were right. It's really something. I think I'm gonna ask her to. Uh... Oh hell no! Oh hell no! My man trying to. You fucking shitting me. I got a ring. It was. They ain't even married. It was Arthur's. I found it in a bundle of things that That's I kept. That's tough. You're marrying Abigail, or it, asking her at least. Oh my! I never took you for a romantic. No, me neither. But <laughs> it's something I've thought about. And I I think I know I want it. Okay. I guess I thought you were married already. Long ago. No, not really. 
Mm. Not officially. Well, I'm real happy for you, John. I feel you, Josh. Being married, it made me real happy. We're cutting off the main track up here by Manzanita Post. Okay. So, we're coming up on where he's been seen. This moron accountant, Marshall Thurwell, been trying to live like an outdoorsman. Amping out here. He's lucky the Skinner brothers ain't found him. Well, they might have. Up here. Must be it. Get down. Let's take a look around. Something's been here. This... This looks... Looks like a bear. Something came through here. <sighs> the fella left in quite a hurry. Here. You can go look at the blood. Uh, it was from the south, whoever he is. Then maybe he's our man. If he ain't become some bear's lunch. Yeah, it looks like they went this way. Him or the bear? <laughs> Both of them. Easy. Mount up. Let's find him. It's that way, I'd say. Great. Longest fucking game of my life. Damn it! I lost the trail. Can you see which way he might have gone? Okay, I think I got him. Follow me. Those X's, those black X's means that my dad. I think he's levitating. He is. Crap. Ooh, well, ain't pretty. Oh boy. That our fella? Maybe. But looks more like a local farmer to me. What's left of one? God damn. Is it gone? You, Marshal Thurwell? That I am, ma'am. I'm here to arrest you on behalf of the state of Lemoyne. You're wanted for theft, fraud, and avoiding arrest. Is the monster still out there? No, I think he's gone. Come out. Come on. No shoes. <laughs> Keep walking. <laughs> Come on. I'm coming. John scared shit with that motherfucker. I'm sorry, I miss that. I think he's gone. Oh, fucking monster. Thurwell! Get out here! Before I come in there and kill you myself! I, I, I'm coming. Pathetic. Waiting to see if that animal ate us? No, ma'am. That weren't it. Yes, it were. Come here. Come here. 
<laughs> Sir Will, call yourself a man? Well, it's like Abigail says. That's one word for you. I can't believe we didn't kill that bastard. Gave him something to remember us by, at least. <laughs> you all right, John? Yeah. <sighs> Just... We always find a way to open... Close get killed, don't we? Mm-hmm. That's kind of the problem. Maybe it wasn't right of me to bring you along on those really heavy things. A family man and all. Seeing all this, I don't know if I can do it again. I'm my own man, ain't I? I get to make those calls. I needed the money. You are your own man, sure. But I'm my own woman. And I get to say who I ride with. And I don't know if your ranch and your kid and your wife are things I want to be worrying about when I hear a gunshot. Yeah, fair enough. Those are fine new clothes, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I spend my cash on fancy. Look at that. Who's this up here? Is that? Are you Sadie Adler, man? The bounty hunter? Get off the road! Look, I got great respect for you professionally, but if that's Marshal Thorwell there, uh, me and my partner would like to split the reward. You're doing what? Get off the road! We was thinking you might need protection. I look like I need protection? Uh, me and my partner, we're dead set on splitting that reward. And if not, well, we said we was going to take all of it. <laughs> Y'all ain't too smart. Stupid decision by them, huh? Yep. It does require a certain level of detachment. You ever think if it's right? No. I just see orders on the wall. And I try and fill them. And if there's other bastards after the same orders as I am, I get competitive. It's called industry. And if you ain't noticed, everyone is out there doing it. I guess they are. Uh, you said earlier you knew something about Micah. You gonna tell me what you know? Are you sure you want to hear about it? Ain't all that back at your ranch enough? If I find him, I will handle No, you fucking won't. Your bounties or transport work? That's your decision to bring me along or not. But, but Micah? That's something we, well, I, I gotta do, with or without you. You're goddamn right. You know what I mean? Okay, okay, I know. Well, I'm hearing things. A lot of things. Still, mostly just whispers, but I think you might be pretty close. When you hear something real, you bring it to me. Okay, I'll bring it to you. But... You think about if this is what you really want. Oh shit, that's probably how they get together. He John kills Micah and the the FBI or whoever the fuck they are, they take him in. Damn. Everything you can get mm. and everything you could lose. Damn, I didn't think about that. That makes sense. Here. Put him down. Go on. Get home to your wife. I'll let you know if I hear anything about Micah. You need a hand taking him in? Him? <laughs> no, I'm fine. You sure? Yeah. I'll send your share to the bank when I get paid. Thank you.
Happy Gale mission. Coming on, girl. Constantly looking at the progress for the story. 90. Wow. Finally at 90. How about that shit? Let's take a look see what we got. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. There should be one more mission in the prologue. This Abby Go mission should be the end of the prologue because part one only had 10 missions in it. And this one hopefully only has 10 missions in it. Hopefully. I mean, we only got 10% more left of the story, which is good. As long as we're not going to get hit with something stupid. I might, I might want to make a save. I wish I made a save with Arthur before I did all this. That would have been a smart idea. Like before Arthur got sick. Or before Arthur died. But I didn't. So. Fantastic. You might give me the choice after we beat the game to, to do something. You might give me a choice whether I, who I want to play as. Because to be completely fucking honest, I'd much rather play as Arthur than John. I'd rather go back in time and play with Arthur than play with current John. I think that is. around here before you came back. You're just lucky I'm a soft touch. I should sling you out by your ear. Uh, it's walk or work, old man. I got a lumbago. You'll have I more than that. Oh, John, tell her about my health. Do what the lady says. I've worked my fingers to the bone building this place, Abigail Roberts. Marston! Abigail Marston. Miss Marston to you. Miss Marston to you. Why you let him stay? He's actually been pretty useful in a useless sort of way who's that no idea friend or foe nobody we'll soon good find out it's the gettys boys from proghorn ranch yeah mr milton mr milton duncan sir ma found some old furniture in the attic ma thought maybe you folks would want it as a housewarming present you know uh they send their regards uh, how kind they are Tell your mom, Paul, we're very touched. Where would you like the furniture? Uh, just over here. Then we can arrange. Who the fuck is walking this up is my goddamn? Y'all see that? You saved the ranch. The Paul said this is the least he could do. Well, that's about everything. <laughs> Send your pa my best regards. Tell him he's got friends for life in me and my family. Bye, sir. Ma'am. I can't believe this. It's so kind. Sure. But there's still some more things that we need to get. How about we take a ride into town? It's been ages since we spent any time together. It has. God, Abigail is a lot uglier than this than she was in the first one. It's kind of ridiculous. Okay, let's go. I feel like we ain't done nothing together like this since... Since, uh... Since forever? Maybe not forever, but a long time. We ain't had the time, you know? We've both been working hard. And now we got something to show for it. The ranch. This life. It's so nice, John. Come on, woman. May I help you, my lady? <laughs> oh, John. things we still needed. We can buy them from that catalog. Let's go have some fun. I know your idea of fun, John Marston. Oh, I ain't had a drink and well I left those things behind me. No wait, what the fuck did she ever do to help? She acts like she was <laughs> Yeah. I mean good. Yeah she acts like also, she uh like uh 
She's done a lot. She hasn't done shit. She didn't do shit in the game. That's fun. What would you like to do? Maybe get our portrait took. I don't think she was the. In Red Dead Redemption One, they said she was like the whore. Everybody passed her around. But in the this, they didn't. I don't think. I want a picture of us, me and you. Okay. I actually don't think they did. Sure. Maybe I'm just imagining that. I don't know. Let's just walk around. That could be bullshit. I don't know. I do have to be back by dinner time. Uncle Jack and Charles will manage fine without you. Hell, looking after themselves may even be good for them. <laughs> They'll starve. That may be good for them, too. With any luck, Jack and Charles will eat up. <laughs> Don't get my hopes up. <laughs> so maybe you're right. We'll stay. You know I am. Okay, then. Orchard it is. Hi there. Oh, she did put John on the ground. Well. If anybody see that, that's what really aggravated me is Arthur had such a bitch ass ending. Like it was such a bitch ass ending. John had such a prolific ending. Like when he died, it was like fuck, dude. Like it it took a lot of motherfuckers to kill John. Arthur's was a whole lot tougher than John, and he got shot in the head by some little bitch. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> by one of his gang members? That's fucking ridiculous. John got shot 20, 30 fucking here. times by the army. Uh. What type of stupid shit was that? Let me help you down. Why are you being so courteous? I don't know. There you go. I'm going to head to the drapers for a minute. Won't take long, but I need to get some materials. You want to come with me or wait here? And after that, we can go get our photo taken? Yeah, after that, we can get our photo taken. Oh, you better calm down. All right, let's get that picture taken. It means that much to you. It does. Today it does. Something's gonna happen. You're acting kind of funny. I am kind of funny. <laughs> A different kind of funny. Something's gonna happen. Am I annoying you? No. I like this version of you. It just, <laughs> it just ain't you. Well, maybe I've changed. <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know. Probably not. The fuck? My man's running into the wall. Hello, madam. Sir. Hello, sir. How can I help you? We're... We'd like to get our photo taken. Oh, a photo. Yes, yes, that I can help you with. Yes. So... What do we do? I'm sorry, what did, what did you want? Oh my god. Uh, our portrait taken. Oh, well, we do that. Yes, wonderful. Handsome couple, quite something, but you need a background. A background? Yes, we have Niagara Falls, Paris by night. <laughs> we have Mount Vesuvius and its ruins. We have the open prairie. T take a Take a look. Pick one. What do you think? Let's see the others. How about this one? It's dramatic, ain't it? <laughs> Let's see what else they got. This is pretty. Or spooky, maybe. Let's see everything. That's nice. It's like being back home. Was that all of them? This is, uh, mm, this is a bar. Surely there's a photograph of you in a bar already. Look, this was your idea, John. It's up to you. You've seen all of them. Anything you like?
Right, Svan. Ah, this one. Wonderful. That will be simply perfect. You know, I wish I had the Congo River, but they require grass skirts. I couldn't afford them. It's just so exotic. You stay there. I'll make a pose that you feel comfortable with. Well, this is dignified. <sighs> Try to enjoy. I think I'd rather be cleaning the outhouse. Be quiet. Thought you were a cowboy, not a poser. Oh, no. I'm a poser. I learned from the best. That is true. Feel free to use the chairs if you want. How's this? Bravo! Fuck. Now, give me a minute. I'm going to develop this for you. Wait here. Take your time. <laughs> what? Nothing. Nothing at all. Tough guy. Going slim. Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say anything. You better calm Just down, bitch. Post. Shut up. <laughs> you know, you're not very nice to me. Oh, I'm nicer than you deserve. <laughs> True. <laughs> here. Came out beautifully. <gasps> sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, look at that face on you. Be quiet. <laughs> what do I owe you? Five dollars. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. I'll see you again. Oh, yes. He'll probably come in for a pose. He seemed to enjoy himself. <laughs> Bye now. <laughs> What shall we do now? There is one thing I hadn't done. I've never been to see one of them moving picture shows. Jeez. Never? No. Well, come on. Let's go do that. You sure? Of course. It's the marvel of the age. I love marvels. <laughs> okay, good. Well, let's go. Thank you. It's, it's real fine doing normal things. The fuck was Thank that? Thank you. <laughs> What's playing? Something called sketching for sweetheart, I think. Oh, hello. Two tickets, please, to see sketching for sweetheart. That'll be 50 cents, please. Okay. What's it about? I have no idea. Thank you again. Come on in. Mystery awaits. It's just incredible. It's like they're really there. Hey, I'm trying to watch this. John Marston. I'd normally just leave this, but I remember the last time I <laughs> thought you might be cool. I remember the last time I did it, it fucked up. <laughs> That's women for you. Don't you dare, John Marston. What? I'm watching. Please. Shh. It looks so real. It's not. Don't be such a sour puss. Shh. <laughs> Stop it. She's a piece of work. Really? Shh. Oh my. Is it over? I think so. Come on. Be seeing you. No, you All won't. Right. <laughs> we better get home. <laughs> oh, we never get out. 
The farm will be fine. <sighs> the farm. I love hearing that. Let's go down to the lake for a minute. The lake? Sure. <laughs> Why, you finally gonna drown yourself? In a manner of speaking, I guess I am. <laughs> Happily so. You're acting real strange. Yeah, no, yeah, not. yeah. Come on. You're a silly man, John Marston. <laughs> what, what about Jim Milton? Oh, he's even worse. Let me help you in. <laughs> like I said, mighty strange. I like to row. <laughs> Since when? You can hardly swim. I don't plan on capsizing. I wonder whose boat this is. It don't matter. We'll have it back. I hope they don't think we're... They won't think anything. Don't think. We're borrowing. I hope it don't got leaks or nothing. She's seaworthy, okay? <laughs> Relax. Look around. All I can see is a strange man rowing. <sighs> Here's good. Ain't it pretty? Jesus. What are you asking? There it is. Go ahead. You. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Fantastic. This you is great. <laughs> Get up. I am married to you. No, I mean proper. In front of God. You That's serious? Gay shit is that. I got this ring. I've had it for a long time. Take it. Oh, sh she didn't even say yes, you stupid ass. You serious? It would make me very happy if you would... We've lived a lot of lives. Let's just live what? this one from now on. What? You and me, Jack, a family, by law. John, I... I never... I didn't know it mattered to you. It didn't. What? But now it does. If you think this is dumb, I'm... I'm sorry. <laughs> Shut up, you silly man, and kiss me. <laughs> Fantastic. Part three. <laughs> Fuck. Hit me with a part three. That had to been the end of part two. No way it wasn't. No way it wasn't. Not on your life. What the fuck? You better calm down. <laughs> you better calm down, blood. The fuck are you doing? Whoa. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> It's going to make me take control right here. Wow, it didn't end the fucking shit. That's crazy. Fan fucking fantastic. We get to go back and do another fucking mission. How, what's our progress look like now? 91, fantastic. I was right, that's 10. It's 10. That was 10, this is... 
Okay, well, prologue part two is long, apparently. We're getting loud ass music though, you hear that? You hear the music? Leads me to believe that this has to be the last mission. Rescued. Sir, I love it. I truly love it. Abigail, dear, what's for dinner? Uh. What's for dinner? Away with you, you no good parasite. You cook. Actually, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> John, come out here. Oh, fuck. Hey, John. Abigail. Sadie. Charles. I found him. I found Micah. No. I got a lead. One of his boys wanted for murdering a woman. Been seen drinking in strawberries. If we can get to him, he'll lead us to Micah. But I gotta go now. You coming? No. He's not coming. I will. That's your business. His business is here. Yeah. Yeah, I'll ride with you. No, I'm... <laughs> Abigail, 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 Abigail. Do, y you don't understand, honey. Honey, honey, make the, cook the fucking dinner. Calm the fuck down, cook the dinner, I'll be back. All right? God damn. I'm begging you. No. You risk all this? For what? For Micah? All this? All this wouldn't exist if it weren't for Arthur, Sadie. Right. And all the folks that fell. If I let him go, this place ain't no more real than... Then one of Jack's dragons. I'm begging you. And I'm begging you to understand. This is it. This is... Please. Please try to... I ain't got no other choice. Keep an eye on the place for me. Of course. Please. Why are you crying? Why, why are you, <laughs> I'm confused, like, why is this bitch trying? I mean, like, for what? Let's go kill this son of a bitch, then. Come on, let's get to Strawberry before he dries out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is where it all ends. Sadie dies, Charles dies. Which one Something Mike stupid. Is Clayton. Which one was Cleet? The big one or the little one? The one with the rat face. My memory is they both had rat faces. Oh, the those two kids. with the rat face then. Him? <laughs> yeah, he'll talk. You're damn right he will. We owe this to Arthur. You're goddamn revenge. right you do. That might be something he could have understood. This ain't just revenge. It's about stopping the man. I hear you're taking bounties now. And I hear you're building houses. Mm-hmm. <laughs> when I'm not killing old friends. Hell. Nowadays, I'm almost always killing old friends. Old friends and new. Ain't that right, John? It seems that way. You interested in bounty hunting, Charles? My last assistant <laughs> was put out to pasture. No, <laughs> that work ain't for me. I, uh, I think I might get out of here. Go north. Canada. Find a woman. Start a family, if I can. I see how that life... Well, I'd like to try it. Oh, hey, John. You've given him the family book. I thought we would have inspired him to a life of celibacy and isolation. Hmm. You know, I've been thinking I might get out of here, too. Okay, so maybe Down they don't South die. South America, maybe? It's wild, but less mean, I guess. I'd learn protection for a gold mine, or take up with a handsome revolutionary. I don't know. Something. See something else at least. That all sounds good. Yeah, it all sounds real fine. But we got some business to take care of first. Okay. You got damn right we did. This is it. We leave our horses by the bridge, then we find it. You don't think that's that wagon just Okay. John, Charles, you take the other side of the river. I'll stay on this one. If we meet in the middle, we would have covered most of the town. If he's here, we'll get him. Okay. Let's go. There. Clay! Hey, Clay! Been a 
while. Stop that man! He's wanted for hey. murder! Hey, stop! 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 Can't escape us, Cleve! Ain't no point in trying! Come here, friend! I don't know this you thing! Got Remember us? Joe, you're gonna take a turn? Hey, 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 we're all buddies, ain't we? Sure, Sadie. With pleasure. Now, where's Micah? Micah? I ain't seen you. Stop it. Micah! Stop. Where? Yeah, you better fucking tell, tell me, me, motherfucker. You better fucking stop, tell stop, me, stop, you stop. piece of shit. No, 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 no. Where's Micah? I don't know. I ain't seen him. We fell out. And you know what? I'm bored of this. Let's hang the bastard. What? Good idea. Oh, wait, hold on. Bring him up to the gallows. Ah, no, stop it! Move it! Drag him over here! Oh, my neck! No, you stay away. Climb! I, I swear. You heard the lady. Get up there! No, no, come no, here, no, you no. bastard! Move me! Come on, move! Come on there. Here, I want you stood right here. Still. All right, string the no good murdering bastard up. Let's try this again. Uh, Where's Mike? Uh, no, 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 no. Where is he? Where's Mike? I already told you I ain't seen him. You lie. It ain't my fault. He tried to kill me. Where's Micah? Talk, or I'll pull this lever. Talk. No, 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 no. Stop! Wait, 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 wait. He, he's up in the mountains. Yeah. I think he's, he's up in Mount Hay Gang. We got a whole gang now. Bad man. Doing bad things. I, I tried to stop him from murdering that little girl. We fell out. Honest. Please, I'm, I'm one of the good guys. Uh -huh. Hang him. No. No. You got what you came for. No. He's dead. Thank you. Well done. Come on. A little rat said Mount Hagen. You're a good girl now. It's a long ride. Let's finish this. You're goddamn. You're goddamn skippy. You're goddamn skippy. What's in this fucking shit? Yeah, I don't care how many people we got. We're gonna drink them all. I assume Charles dies first. He has to, right? It's logical. It's logical thing. Wait, Mount what? What did it say? Mount Hagen? Imagine it's Dutch's old place. Oh my god, it fucking might be. We Holy shit, it this might be. Will take us up into the high mountains. The oh way. wow. There's an old watch That'd be a trip. There they might be using for a camp. Somebody just got shot. Get Told you. Look at that. We gotta get closer to Yo, is he not dead?
Okay, so you can't kill that guy. <laughs> Maybe I can. I shot him a lot of times. You got it. Okay. Let's go back to Charles. Yeah. Hey, you're okay. You're okay. I will be. <laughs> go on. Go on now. Move fast. Hey. Look on the mail and kill us all. <sighs> Come on, John. I don't want to leave him. Hey, they know we're coming now. I will be fine. I'll follow you up. I just... I just can't move fast. Okay. Come on, John. Shit. That gliding she just did was incredible. Hoping to get some health from one of these bitches. So I keep looting them. I know I'm gonna need one of those like Yeah, but I I haven't really bought shit. I mean, I, I'm gonna wait to spend money until after the pro or epilogue because I don't know if John's gonna be the character I'm gonna be using after the story's over or what's gonna happen. So there's no reason to even try to do anything else. Can I? Hold on. Can we maintain this? I want to clean this. See if I can clean this at least. Because this does a lot of damage if I can... They just shot my gun. These aren't even express bullets. She just got shot. I think she actually got shot. Get your hands off her. Maka? Yep. I called that though. I called that though. I knew they both would die somehow. You don't look too fine. Come on. You're bleeding pretty bad. It ain't nothing. You should sit down. I'm fine. 
You're dying. I'll be fine. Just sit. It's okay. I, I ain't dying. I ain't. I hope not. I ain't dying. Just go get him. I'll be fine. I just need to rest. Uh, okay. Charles, stay with her. Charles, you worry about yourself. I'll be up there who it is. in a minute. Ain't you got a hat? To just show it up. But I got something to take care of. That was Joe. We gotta be close. Where's Mike? That was Joe. So that's all of the main people that I didn't like. Those were the last people that they had. Bro, come on. Bro, what the fuck? Bad idea. Scarface. Did you miss me? Not much. Been a few years. 
<laughs> How's that, uh, mm, whore of yours? She's good. Didn't reckon I should waste my time killing you. But I felt different. So it seems. Well, maybe after. Wait a minute. Are we are we about to do what I think we're about to do? After all this is over, <clears throat> I'll go pay her a call. Hmm. And the boy. Whatever you say. Oh no, we're not. Damn. Thought we're about to do one of those draws, bruh. Are we? What do we do? Why can I shoot him, dog? Sounds good. Come Just like old times. <laughs> Come on, you turn around and start walking. Bullshit. You got me. Just like old times. Hmm? All manner of folk paying social calls. He's gonna kill her. Obviously. Hello, son. <sighs> you see, this is why I lose interest. This is why I lose interest, bruh. <laughs> like, I called it. Like, I knew this. This these mountains were Dutch's mountains because they're from Red Dead Redemption One. But this is gonna piss me off. This is going to piss me off. Mrs. Adler? It's been quite a while. Now, John. Now. What were you saying? What are you doing here, Dutch? Same as you, I suppose. Dutch and I are teaming up once more. We got money. We got dreams. <laughs> Join us, John. Join us. Let her go. Now I can't do that, John. <laughs> Dutch. Dutch, come on now. You shot at me, son. You started. You betrayed me. I could say the same as you. I was trying to do my best. You? You just cared for yourself. I think differently. Join us. Join us, John. Let her go. She ain't well. I don't want to kill you, John. Arthur saved my life. More than once. Arthur's been dead a long time. This is a new century. Dutch. Dutch. We all did our best for you. Ain't our fault. Things turned out the way they did. Dutch, killing me won't solve nothing. Put down your gun, Master. Say something, Dutch. 
Say something! I ain't got too much to say no more. Good job. He shot me. About time you did jump good. <laughs> you shot me pretty good. How the fuck? Thank you. I, I, what the fuck? You okay? Fine. You're crazy. Well, I hope so. Help me up. Uh, Let's go get Charles. There's money. Lots of money. In the cabin, black water. I'll go see. Hurry up! I got a wedding I want to go to. That's what I wanted to know. I guess we were supposed to shoot him in the chest, but I shot him in the fucking egg face. <laughs> now they can end the game. They can end the game now. It's mighty bitch. That was Jack, perfect. Uncle, come Abigail. It's all over. <laughs> yeah, it is. I'm going to where the sun burns in the heat stays in command. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. Right here, to where the river turns to dust and God is never <sighs> rushed calmly by my side. Right here. Well, I didn't figure they were going to end it that quick. But it's alright, I guess. Seem to make sense when Endless summer, huh? Complete the epilogue. Zero point one percent people have completed it. How about that? That's the grind right there for you. Money for everything. Silver toed boots and kerosene. Come and lay by my side right here. Red, I love you. Oh, the buzzing thing. Oh, cute. He's gonna show us every bit of it. That's cool. I, I thought Charles and Sadie died. Oh, I still sure wanna know what happened to them. Well, where'd they go? Red, I need you in the world. When I see you behind the glass, I forget that I'm in the cage. They bring me to Sunday Mass, but it never the rage red I love you and the world Seven months gone and seven years to go red I uh, can't stay no more I don't know if it be fun or not side, right mm. here. Red I love you It was a fun game I guess It wasn't that bad Red I need you 
Let's see what happens after everything's over. I'm just letting it play out because there's some hid shit it looks like. Or maybe there's not. We'll skip it. We'll just skip it. See what happens. Oh fuck. Yeah, we're playing as John. millstone around our necks, we better try and keep this place going. I paid our debts with that money. I, uh, I don't want to talk about that money. And no more that. Well, it's over, Abigail. I'm sure. Then get to work on this ranch you own, and raising your boy. Yes, ma'am. What are we? Why are am you I being sarcastic, John Marston? Me? <laughs> Never. Good. Anyway, I thought you liked this place. No, John, I don't like it. I love it. It's home. She's not like falling us, is she? Because I'm getting stressed. Alright, I'll just make sure. So, my question is, the progress said there's supposed to be another fucking thing, but how can there be another fucking thing if there's no, okay, we're at 100%, alright, so the last 10% was just that mission, got it, checklist, not bad, not bad, not bad. Not a bad one. Miss Arthur. Wish I could have Arthur back, but it's alright, I guess. Damn, you see all that fucking money? We got $20,000. What? Now that's kind of fucking wild. Beecher's Hope. I'm guessing there's actual shit we have to do for here. That'd be dope, wouldn't it? Let's go find out. What you reading, Jackie boy? What am I supposed to do here? Oh, okay. I was hoping to have like a thing where I could uh... Buy shit maybe? I, I don't... Question, where's Shady and Char... Like, where is... Where are they? Shut up. You want to eat, Tommy? You all right, family, son? family dinner is now available. What the fuck? Is, what what happens now? Like, I understand it's kind of like the open world and shit, but like, where's Charles? Where's Sadie? There you go. You know, like I want to know where they're at. She can cook. Everything tended to. Because they're not here. That aggravates me. There's still some spots. What the fuck? Look, it has the whole entire map, man. I'm telling you, if online has all this shit, it's gonna be wild. Like, I'm not even bullshitting. Just this area was fucking huge. Literally, just all of this was humongous to travel across. We're still wanted. We're still wanted on the, uh... That's funny. I see Armadillo. You see Armadillo right there? I want to go there. 
that is where I want to go. And then we will end the... Uh, We'll end the stream and I'll go do something else. But we're gonna go on, to Armadillo. For sure. Enjoy our fucking time. The red, what's the red place on the map? Where is that? Uh, there's two. One of them was a fort and the other one was a prison that we were at. Or John was at and he broke out of. Now we're in the open, open road. The story is completely done. Now we can do side missions if we want. So we'll probably do them. I think. I think uh, today, today, later today, I'll have. Uh, will be the last day I'll have to do something. The Fallout 76 beta comes out, which I will be live streaming tomorrow. Or yeah, tomorrow. Just today's 29th. Yeah, it goes. There you go. There. I know it came out for Xbox, but I I haven't watched anything on it. I don't even want to. I didn't watch anything on Red Dead Redemption 2, and I was still kind of blown away by how fun it was. Actually, that's a lie. I read a shit ton about it right as it came out. But yeah, me and Rich both are going to be uh, live streaming uh, 76. We're going to both be playing possibly. So it'll be interesting. Coming on, girl. And now, now we'll be waiting for the online to come out. But the online's really, really what made this game fun for me. The story was great, Red Redemption 1, but I've really played a lot of the online. The online was what I played. Oh, he don't he don't live stream on here. Uh, he don't live stream on uh, YouTube. He live streams on some like IRL type shit, like from his phone. Uh, it's called Live dot Me or some shit like that. I don't. Actually, I think that's what it is. Live dot Me or Live Me Live Me dot com. Right. It's like a mobile app. He live streams on. Nice, Billy. Hey, miss. Good to see if we can get a new horse too, because this horse tires out too quickly and it's not fast at all. Let's see if we can sell this one. Why can't 
Let y'all just leave me alone. What do I do? Somebody's burning. Oh shit. What the fuck? Armadillo looks rough right now. Oh, Armadillo's not doing too good. I'm coming out hot. wasn't for you <laughs> how lucky we are the hero we so require armadillo is indebted to you though i fear it may be beyond saving hell i don't fucking know about all that now i don't know what you made of that but it was a close thing and in light of that and the sad demise of this settlement i am resigning my post now you will see that i packed my valise but the accoutrements of my profession remain in my desk. Glad I was able to help you out of that, Sheriff. Said you won't stick around. <laughs> well, so long. I must see about a train. Imagine I just hop up here and get inside of his desk and then I'm the Sheriff. <laughs> John Marston, the Sheriff. Let me search the desk. <laughs> Let me become the Sheriff. Let me be the fucking sheriff, dude. Come on, give me the give me the sheriff's badge. Let me be the fucking sheriff. Wouldn't it be dope? Wouldn't that be fucking dope? Sheriff Rondo. Gun on. Alright, let's uh let's loot their bodies. Yeah, this is a sorry ass area now. Right. up little buddy all right the Sloan's here it's about it what you're telling me they only have a saloon here they don't have like a gun stop nothing they have a general store that's it it's kind of whack there used to be like a gun store and this town is sick stay away stay away why is the town sick Hey, friend. Place is full of cholera. Head in there at your own peril. Well, half the town has died and most of the rest have fled. Still? Sure. A few years ago, it was the scarlet fever. Then really? it was the desert plague. Then typhus. Now the cholera. Bad business. Some folks say the whole town is cursed. Whole town's got cholera! Here, you can read for yourself. Thanks. Sure. Oh, thank you. Arthur was the asshole. John will be the good guy. Fuck it. Thanks. <laughs> don't cough Feel on me, good. bitch. <laughs> Howdy, mister. I have to say, we don't see many new faces around here. What can I get you? Whiskey, please. 
This is this is my area. Like I can't. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving this area. Are you crazy? This this is my area. And whiskey's about the only thing left that's safe to drink in this town. I should warn you. I'm sick, but so is pretty much everyone else around here. Apart from that son of a bitch who runs the general store. That might be the cruelest irony of them all. Call us all. Horrible business, mister. I wouldn't stay around here any longer than you need to. Especially if you got loved ones expecting you home. Anyway, it's already be a misery, friend. A few more drinks and I'll have a smile on my face again. We're looking smug as all hell, son. I mean, what does it matter? You're all gonna die anyhow. Now it just makes everything easier because you're all are, because y'all ain't got a sheriff. Are you crazy? This is, this is easy. Where the fuck did he go? Don't make any. There's not a bank here. You're telling me I can't. Hmm. I'm gonna rob something, I could tell you that much. Somebody's getting robbed. Rotten road. Mm. 
It really ain't gonna let me get in? That's crazy. Girl, what the hell with that? Okay, now. You're a good fit. <laughs> All right. I think I've had my fun. Fun game. Shit, it's come to an end. We'll do some of the other shit, maybe. Very unlikely, <laughs> but I might play this game again, maybe. I'll play it whenever the online comes out for sure. Last guy I'm gonna torture. Do we have a problem? How about you running? My fucking town, pussy. Hey, is no one gonna thank me? I 
Oh, do you not have a head? You know what I hear? I hear a train. I see it. Let's Take the train. Wow, you can rob it. You can rob the train. Oh, shit! The fuck are you okay. doing, idiot? I was reading the comments on my shit, didn't even see the fucking horse coming. They just stop. I don't think there's any passengers on this. I'm going to walk to you, rock. I look like somebody that gets a fuck what you think. My nigga, what? I could drop the train? Oh, bitch. about this shit I bet is that the oh, I was gonna say that's a conductor right there How the fuck are they hitting me?
I'm just driving till I die. Then I'm gonna go watch you do, and then probably go back to sleep. Cool game though. Yeah, fuck it. What the fuck is that? The fact that you could actually drive the fucking train, that's pretty dead. Just saying. Way back here, still following us. Are they following the train or are they following? Oh, they're lost now, I think. Yeah, they're lost. The closer we are to these roads, the closer they're gonna get. I'll take either or. got close killing us. I remember this town. I don't remember what it's called, but I remember this area. Can I pause for a minute? I just want to see what all we've discovered. Tumbleweed, we went around Tumbleweed, Benedict Point, Fort Mercer, where Bill's at. I wonder if we go over there or Bill will be there. That'd be dope, What wouldn't it? Fuck, that'd be fucking wild. Looks like the tracks go... Yeah, no. What's up? All right, I'm gonna save at this point and see if I can uh, maybe get lucky and have it when I come back on have the uh, I don't know.
have it a little closer. Alright. Check the social club, see what that has. If anything, I don't care actually. Alright, well it's been fun. I'll see you later, Josh.